Hey guys, in this video I'm going to have a look at Pipedrive's new lead booster feature which is quite similar to kind of chatbot but then it ties into quite a few of the other um, more powerful features within Pipedrive. So this is the first time I've had a look so let's get started and jump in. First thing we can do is choose the colors of our bot. I might go for this red and white one. We'll continue from there. Profile, we can have Pip. We can have someone else. You can change up the image here, change the name, change the language of it, which is really handy. Um, we've got get more leads, book more meetings, or qualify and route leads. So we might just go for a simple one to get started. We're going to create a playbook for this particular bot. So the first thing it's going to say that we can see here is welcome to our website. And I can click into these, change that say how long I want to have that kind of wait before it starts typing that message. Uh, let's have a look at the wait on this one. No, there's not a wait on there. This is what brought you to our website today. I'm looking to buy, just browsing. I'd like some help. So you can see that from those three options, it comes down and it has the custom messaging that you've got for each of them. This one will bring someone through a, to a disqualified lead, which will just leave with a closing message. You can see here. And this one, I'd like some help, disqualified lead, thanks for reaching out, and it just goes through to an email address. So this is a pretty simple one where you've just got those three questions within here that are being branched out into these three sections. So we've got this qualified lead coming through, comes through, can I have your name, thanks, what's your company name, can I have an email so a member of our sales team can follow up with you as soon as possible, so if I click into that, you can see it's a capture type, it's an email. You might be asking for a phone name, organization name, or a note. So it's going to go through to the email. We're going to have a qualified lead, who the owner is, and we're going to put it into pipeline lead in. We can also set up a schedule a meeting, put some availability, and then have that schedule a meeting as well. So if I click this, actually what I might do, I'll go to the preview. And that just shows me um, the theme that I'm using and I can edit it from there. I might save this one. You can see I've got the more leads there. Embed code. I can copy it um, to my clipboard for WordPress. I can go in there and add that. Let me have a look. You can install and activate it and you put the scripts into the header, so there it is there, you can copy that. If you're using Squarespace, so you'll just put that into the using the code injection. And we've also got a Google Tag Manager option as well. So we've got a few options for being able to embed it so that it will be popping up on your website um, and you'll be able to just go through that whole flow with clients. So let's have a look here. I'm here to buy, what can we help you with? I can put in my name kind of try some things out over here but that just gives you a little rundown of it so it looks like a really simple way of doing it I'm sure some of you would have more complex flows than just this kind of three question flow like you might have it that this is leading down towards a qualified lead this asks some more qualifying questions before being disqualified and maybe there's something that just ends up being straight disqualified but yeah it looks like a great Thing to add to your website and a really easy way of being able to lead people towards um, either additional conversations and putting them through into a lead pipeline, scheduling a meeting or disqualifying them and perhaps even leading them to another page on your website through using that link functionality.